Okay, good morning for me and my Renty baby. Good morning, welcome back to my channel. Wow, last night was one of the hardest nights I've had. This is like one of the second hardest nights. And it's funny that I had a really hard last, hard night last night, God can't talk, because my snoo is being delivered today and I am so happy that it's coming at this point. If this is not a perfect baby and a perfect mom to try out the snoo, I don't know what is. Maybe that's the universe trying to align everything to share how great or not so worth it this new is because this will be a great baby to try it on. <laughs> Last night around, I would say between like eight and 10, he was sleeping a lot. He was sleeping a lot on me. He was sleeping a lot on Cody. I just wanted a break. So I was letting him just sleep away. And I totally regret it because he was up every two hours. He was up from two to like five or six in the morning, like awake. That was a very long wake window for him. It was just a mess, honestly. He's five weeks old and yeah, he, I just nursed him right now. <laughs> He's a very noisy baby. I can tell he's a little stomach issues going on or something. He's like grunting over there and he's not asleep at all right now. But I just nursed him so I'm able to have an energy drink because this is all I got. Um, so yeah, I'm going to vlog today. It's a day in the life basically of a newborn and a mom of three. And we're gonna see what the snoo is all about. I wanna do a whole video of the actual night with the snoo. Like this video and comment if you guys want me to make a full like whole night video of it because I think that could be interesting. Um, yeah, today is going to be a very tired day. Rain has a doctor's appointment today too. Um, he is having his one month checkup and yeah. Let's just see where the day takes us, because I am exhausted. So this new is supposed to come today. Look at this box. This looks like it's seen better days. This is actually from Dixon. I am collecting, if you don't know what Dixon is, they sell, they're, they're most uh, famous. They're most known for their uh, flannels. I have a lot of their flannels. Um, but they also have been coming out with studded cups and I got the pink one it's so cute and then I also got a hoodie it's actually really thick and nice quality I'm surprised I haven't had one of their hoodies before so this is their hoodie to zip up I just thought it was cute what it said So I have been giving Rain these probiotic drops and they do really help a lot. They're for colic and digestion and I don't know what it is about them. I haven't really found what in the what ingredients cause it but he always goes to sleep after I take these so, or after he takes these not after I take them he takes them. Um, so yeah I really like these I'll link them down below. So this is the Love Every Play Gym. I am not sponsored by Love Every, but they did send me this for free and I do have an affiliate link down below if you guys want to purchase using my discount link. Um, this Play Gym is so cute. Like it's such great quality and I love that it has like all the little tags and it has little noises. It has like flaps so you can like either cover it or um, show it has little dangly things. I'm gonna put him on it right now. He really likes it, and my six-month-old nephew was on it, and he really loved it. The baby. Here he goes. So it's really good for tummy time. And they also have these play kits, which come in this box, and this is a subscription. I think this is such a cool idea. I just think the concept is really cool and the quality is amazing. Like that's the thing that I really love. So here's everything that comes in the box. It's so cute. It has little cards and the black and white things that newborns really love. There's a little silicone rattle with a ball that you can remove. Just cute toys that they can really learn with. I love that. 
Everything's safe, which is great too. They have these really cute little sensory links and they also sent Everly a um, box too. They have boxes from newborn all the way up to Everly's age, um, which is really cool. And I'll show you guys what they got her. She got the storytelling kit. So it's all like make believe stuff, which is really cute. Here's another thing that was in the box. This is really cute. It's all made out of wood and it has little pictures, the black and white again for the age range. It's so cute and I just love the quality of everything. Everything is so nice and it's gonna last you. And he's super content down here. You can go ahead and try some tummy time too. he's down there this is the box that they sent for Everly this is the storyteller kits for months 40 41 42 I think there might be another box after this I'm not quite sure but we already went through it the other day but here is everything that it comes with it comes with this whole what yes that's what it makes it makes a little pop-up theater which is so cute it has these um, puppets little book it has this really cute puzzle it's very good quality again we kind of went through it she was like tearing it all apart wow, it's a book. but this puzzle is so Look. cute a book yep it's all about pretending nice and then it had this cute little spray mop this looks just like the one that I have um, so it's all pretend stuff which is perfect yeah, for her age He's falling asleep, babe, on his stomach. Yeah, he's going to sleep. But I just want to say thank you again to Love Every for sending everything and definitely check them out. I will leave all the links down below. So it is 11.35 right now. We are actually at, I don't know if you guys can see where we're at. Probably not. <laughs> we're at Harley Davidson right now because Cody is most likely getting a motorcycle. Oh, you guys, I am like going through it a little bit today. Um, last night was really rough and I was laughing about it when I woke up this morning, but like I can feel it now. Like I'm just, I feel so overwhelmed, honestly. I really hope that snoo works. Try not to put too much expectation that it's gonna like make everything different because it's a bassinet. Like he's a newborn. I'm trying to be just patient with it all, but you know, it gets rough and it gets hard. And I don't know, I'm just feeling just hormonal and I'm mad. I'm feeling just all kinds of feelings. I wanna cry, like, I don't know. But anyways, um. Cody is getting a motorcycle. It's kind of like his anniversary gift. I'm just feeling so angry. I don't know why. Like, I don't know if this is postpartum depression. Cody keeps kind of checking in with me weekly. Like, are you feeling okay? And I don't think it is. I think I'm just tired and I'm like just cranky from being tired and from being like 
just go 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 always needing always needing to give to everyone else and I don't think I'm having enough time for myself that's what it is and I don't do well when I haven't had my alone time and time to just kind of fill up my own cup um, I'm just just giving and giving and giving and giving and I I'm running out of that and it's I start to get resentful and better and mean and bitchy when I'm just continuing to give without having that for myself. I need to spend a few hours without feeling guilty because that's another thing. As soon as I start to do that for myself, I feel bad and I'm tired of that. Like, I don't need to feel bad about taking care of myself. I need to just kind of turn the attitude around you know like this is part of life this is the life we're the stage of life we're in and you know I'm acknowledging all the hardships and the way I'm feeling right now but I'm not gonna let myself get stuck in it because that's an ugly hole to climb out of and I'm not gonna go there I'm grateful for my family and this is it this is the part of life we're in and we're gonna embrace it and move on through so I think I'm gonna go in now that rain seems to be a little more content. We have a doctor's appointment in about an hour, so we'll see what's going on. I can't believe that you came into my life. You made me feel again. Now it's my turn. You say you've always been a little bit shy, but I can put an end to your fears let me show you a place where you go on to move your feet until they start to be dj take it away tonight is over all right so we are back home it's 3 15 right now rain did get a shot at his appointment so he's a little fussy just nursed him i think i need to change him again cut these cookies up so we can all try some and this new got delivered so Cody's gonna help me um, put that together. All right, so we just set up the snoo and it says that he's calm. We just put him out here for right now. I wasn't sure how he would do with the arms being put down because he loves his arms flailing, but he's okay right now. So we'll see if he'll take a nap in it. Curious to see how it works tonight. Hi guys, so I forgot to actually end that vlog. Let me know if you guys want to see like a 24 hours with the snoo or some sort of review. I'm thinking about doing that. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog. I'm actually vlogging right now today. It is Sunday. So I will see you guys in the next vlog. Bye. I can't believe that you came into my life.